When most people think of Canada, they probably think of hockey, the Canadian Football League, and maybe even maple syrup. But something else is gaining popularity in the Great White North, professional golf. The Mackenzie Tour, the PGA's Canadian golf circuit, gives world-class golfers a chance to take the next step on their path to the top. Former Liberty golfers Robert Carlson and Chase Marinell are gaining a lot of experience on the tour. In his second year on the tour, Robert Carlson has learned a lot of valuable lessons. You're gonna have the courage to let go of control to be able to gain control kind of thing. You're gonna just be able to trust with what you have and don't try to like make it perfect, you know, because it's not a game of perfect. Everyone's gonna hit good shots every week, but it's about what happens when you hit a bad shot that's gonna like define if you're gonna be in the top or miss the cut, you know. And for Chase Marinell, it's all about having the right attitude. You know, I'm on the course and I might shoot a 78 or 76, a pretty bad round, and I have the exact same attitude as if I shot a 66. You know, it's whether I'm four over or four under, I'm the exact same person. I don't let it uh, get to me, and I know there's a, a greater purpose to life than defining yourself by your golf score. These two are no strangers to the pressures of competing. Carlson is Liberty Golf's all-time stroke leader, and Marinell is second. And even though they're no longer on the same team, their friendship has been a valuable asset on tour. So we got to kind of like the same mindset, both on the golf course and off the golf course, we kind of like, kind of laid back. We roomed together one tournament and uh, we both got a top 10 in that tournament. So I think uh, it was a good thing for us to be hanging out and kind of brought us uh, into an old comfort zone, like in college. With Robert's extra year of experience, he's been able to pass on some of that knowledge with his fellow alum. I hope that I've been sharing a lot from my mistakes last year that I did my first year here, so, he, so he's not gonna do them this year. Golf is quite similar to life, so if you let it, this game is gonna like, it's gonna eat you up from the inside, you know? So you, you gotta just be relaxed. It sounds like a cliche, but you just gotta stay in the moment and just stay positive, you know? And for Chase, his faith has kept him grounded with the ups and downs of being a rookie. Staying in the word has been a good thing for me because I can really stay stable in my faith and not get too uh, wrapped up in the idea of where I'm at and what I'm trying to achieve and it's just kind of kept me in the moment. As they continue to pursue their dreams, Chase realizes that his true purpose goes far beyond the golf course. I get to live out my dream every single day and it, it can get tough at times. I've been blessed to be able to come up to Canada during the summer and uh, enjoy my dream. It's been great.